All right, Mayday, 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 Mayday. I don't know what this is. Batman Arkham Shadow. Let's go to the video. Let's go. I'm excited. As soon as I saw this, I stopped everything I was doing. Meta Quest. Wait. wait. Oculus Studios. DC. Is that a... Not actual gameplay. Wait, whoa, 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 what's this? Wait, whoa, 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 wait, wait, hold up, wait a minute, hold up. First of all, all right, so wait, is this like, is this is a VR game, right? Wait, didn't, wait, hold up, all right, I'm confused, I got a lot of questions, my mind is in like a, is in like a big disarray. I'm pretty sure back then, not I, not back then. I'm not like I'm. I'm not saying like you know in the 1700s, but I'm just saying. So like back then, in like the I probably say like five six years ago, I'm pretty sure there was like a Batman VR game. I think, um, but like my memory of that is pretty vague. But I'm gonna be honest with you. Um, I've never heard of Batman Arkham Shadow before in my life. I'm gonna be honest with you. I've never heard of that before. In my because at first, whenever I first seen this, I was like, wait a minute. So is this like an existing game that's just going in the VR? And I was like, wait a minute, I've never even heard of Batman Arkham Shadow before ever in my life. And it's a VR game, Oculus Studios. So it's going to be so it's gonna be on a, uh, Oculus. I'm really excited for this because, you know, obviously Batman Arkham, like the whole Batman Arkham series, uh, you know, is my favorite, you know, superhero series ever. And, you know, and that's just my opinion. But I got a few questions. Uh, I mean, I just asked a few questions, but like, I got I got like a few more questions. Um, you know, my number 600th question uh, right now is is this going to be a part of like you know the of the original like batman arkham series because the last game that was a part of the batman arkham series was suicide squad kid of justice league and you know and, and our and our boy and our boy is dead so i don't know i don't know if i don't know if our boy i don't know if, if uh, i don't know if, if you know if this is going to be like the same batman um I'm just I'm confused like I don't know <laughs> like obviously it's a teaser trailer so like you're, they're not really supposed to give us anything but like I'm still like bro I, I'm in this look at look at the goat look at the look at the uh, everybody shut up everybody sit sit back sit down and eat your popcorn because this is greatness at its finest now again I don't know if this is like you know I don't know if this is our boy you know I don't know like, I don't know, bro, because I was pretty confused. I mean, they said it was canon. They said that, you know, that our boy, you know, our Bruce Wayne, the guy we've been, you know, repping for 10 years, they said that he was, like, officially dead. Like, they said that that was, like, canon, um, which I still don't believe. I don't care. I'm delusional. I, 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 I'm not believing in that at all. Um, last time I checked, our boy is still alive. He's probably, like, at his mansion right now with Alfred, bro, playing dominoes or something. Like, bro, there's, there's no way our boy lost to four custodians, but that's for another video. I wonder if they're going to be using, like, the same, like, you know, um, if they're going to be using, like, the same Batman for this game. I've never in my life ever played, a, like, a superhero, like, VR game before ever in my life. So, you know, we'll see how this is. It says it's coming out late 2024. Um, but, yeah, as soon as I saw Batman Arkham, I was like, hold up. Like, what? And then I'm thinking, automatically, I'm thinking, okay, it, you know, this must be an existing game. Uh, you know, already out somewhere, but then I'm like, hold up, it didn't even say VR in the title, it just said Batman Arkham Shadow, and I'm like, like, what is this, like, ho like hold up, like, I I'm sorry, like, my heart is beating a little bit, like, my heart's beating fast a little bit, I'm like, hold up, wait, wait a minute, I thought our boy just, I thought our boy just got killed by a fake clown, a shark, uh, the fake Flash, and a fake dead shot. Like I thought I thought our boy just got killed by four custodians. I thought our boy just got killed by four lunch ladies. You know, that's what I was thinking. I thought I, I you know, that's what I thought at first, but I'm like, "Hold up. Like th there might this might be a possibility that Rocksteady was lying. Like this might be a possibility that Rocksteady was um uh, what does the youth say? Uh capping. They were they were capping about our boy um that we've been, you know, playing with, you know, ever since we were like little, you know. So, um Maybe it is. Maybe maybe this guy's in like a different universe or something. I don't know, bro. There's there's so many different storylines and and cross lines and stuff like that uh, about like superheroes and stuff like that. So we don't know. But let's all be delusional for a little bit and, and, and let's just say this is the same Batman. Now, if this is the same Batman, let's first of all, this looks like Gotham. 
I don't even have to like question where we are. Bro, look at look, they got all they got all types of Oh, wait a minute. There might be Easter eggs and stuff. Wait a minute, hold up. What's this on the side? I don't, I don't know what's this on the side. I thought this was like some type of like Xbox box or something like that. So like I I don't know. But this is definitely Gotham though. Look, like, look at the apartment buildings, whatever. Like Gotham is Gotham is basically like a it's basically like New York, basically. It's like a dirtier New York. <laughs> It's like New York on steroids. That's that's literally what Gotham is. Um, one more question. Now, immediately, whenever I saw like this rat, I'm thinking, hold up, like, are, are there any villains that like correlate with like a rat? And so in my mind, I'm like, all right, well, no, like I haven't really thought of a villain. Even like I'm trying to like think about villains like back then and like old like Batman, um, like shows and movies and stuff like that. And like, I can't really find one. Like I can't really. I feel like I feel like I know one, but I can't find one though. No, I mean I, I can't find one. And then like this scene right here where all the rats get together, they're you know, they're trying to jump the goat and stuff like that. Obviously it's not gonna happen. But like first of all, this animation right here looks absolutely amazing. I, I listen, I'm just excited. I don't know what's to come. Um I wish we can get another Batman Arkham game, especially in this time, but um, you know, it, it's just this whole series, it was it was ahead of its time, man. Like let's just all admit, Batman, like the whole, like the entire Batman Arkham series, which is ahead of his time. Uh, it is what it is. I mean, that's that's just, it is what it is, man. Like our boy, our boy really died to four custodians. Like I would never get over that. I would never listen. And I love Rocksteady. I love Rocksteady. I have no problem with them. Whatever. Ninety nine percent of what I'm saying is like you know troll or whatever. But like honestly, like you know, um. Yeah, it's just crazy knowing that our guy, the same guy that took on like an, he, he he legit, bro would legit drop 40 enemies a night like LeBron. Like, like this Batman was taking out 40 plus guys a day, sorry, not a day, a night like LeBron James. This man would suit up every single day at 730. He'll suit himself up and everything. And this man was just going to hunt and a prey to take down every villain for every, bro, he did this every night. This is our guy, the guy that took on an army. He took on like uh, Arkham Knight's army, bro, and, and and he got and he got killed by four custodians. I, I can't get over that, but it is what it is. You know, we can't dwell on the past. Whenever, um, oh, that man, I, I I don't I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say, man. And obviously, it said not actual gameplay. You know, which is obviously, it's like a um like this animation specifically for the teaser and stuff like that. But like, bro, look at this, bro. Look at this! Like, look at like, look at his presence! Like, you can see the outline uh, 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 of just like the goat right there. Like, this is literally like this is literally like the greatest of all time. And then you have like all these rats and stuff. Like, who are these rats? Like, who are they like standing for? Like, what what's the point of like these rats? Like, I'm trying to like like dissect everything. Like, we're in chemistry class, but like I'm not really getting nowhere with this. But other than that, man, um, I, oh, bro, I can't wait to see, like, what villains we got in this, too, because obviously, you know, it's a Batman game. There has to be villains, so I reckon we'll probably see Catwoman. Catwoman in VR sounds a little diabolical. Um, Joker in VR sounds scary. Um, I hope they put Professor Pig. Professor Pig is a very, very, very underrated villain that not a lot of people know. Well, some people probably know about. Um, I think that's, like, the worst villain of all time. Uh, not, not in the sense of, like, oh, he's just bad. I'm talking about like in, this, in the sense of like just ruthlessness and like just just crazy like, and the reason I say that is because like, Professor Pig can be like a normal person off the street, like this like just think about it. He's not a guy that's like, he's not like he doesn't have any like superpowers or whatever. Like this guy legit can be like a normal guy off the street, just like, you know, killing people and, uh, well, taking people and trying to reconstruct their face and trying to make their face all perfect and stuff like that. It, it, it's just crazy. So like that man's whole like origin story. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I'm going all over the place, but I just want to express to y'all that Professor Pig is probably the worst, most diabolical villain. Um, and I would think I would think he's worse than I think he's worse than Joker. Like Joker, yes, Joker goes around just like mass killing people and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, it's more towards Batman. That's more like you know, obviously like the more people the Joker kill, you know, it's for Batman. It's like their whole like you know, rivalry or whatever, which makes sense. But I think Professor Pig just, he don't do it for nobody. Like, he just, he just does it just to do Like, and this man wears, like, a pig, like, he wears, like, a pig, like, mask as well. Like, this man's a freak. Like, he's a school threat. And that could legit be, like, anybody. Like, and I feel like that's, 
that villain is more human like 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 you're more likely to you're more likely to see a professor pig in the street than a joker like bro it, let, let's let's think about it if we see a guy with white paint on his face whatever that's just pale as a joker or as pale as Sheamus from WWE with the with the clean purple suit on with some gloves and he has this hysterical laugh Bro, we're all calling the cops, bro. We're all calling the National Guard immediately, bro. That bro, that man is getting surrounded by a th by thirty thousand guns, bro. If he moves one time, bro, make that man do the Macarena. So like, bro, 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 we all know that man is the is is literally a flashing warning sign. He's a flashing red button, okay. The pig, on the other hand, bro, that man could disguise as anybody, bro. He, bro, listen, he could he could work a regular job. He come home, fixing up people's face playing opera music like bro like if you think about it that's more of the believable like you know route as a villain like somebody that you don't really like the joker's out there like obviously his appearance he's out there the professor pig bro he's not out there bro that man could he could be a football coach bro come home be be uh giving people plastic surgery on their face whatever then if he mess up he kill him he playing opera music like it is just cra he wearing the pig mask, bro. And then he does it all. He does it every single day. It's crazy. Like it's crazy how like if you really like put it into depth, like a lot of these villains are like you know out there and like you know they're shining red buttons. But like people like Professor Pig, people like I, I was about to say the Riddler, like somebody that's really smart, that's like really diabolical, whatever. And like I said this before, I, I don't want to go on like a, a Batman tangent or a Batman villain tangent. But one more thing, the Riddler is it, the Riddler is very um. Here's what I feel like. I feel like if the Riddler really wanted to get away with a lot of things, uh, maybe he could stop leaving clues for Batman. But that's his whole thing. His whole thing is for, you know, his riddles to get answered. And if it, and if his riddles don't get answered, this man becomes more of a school threat. So I don't know why I just gave you guys a lesson on, like, Batman villains. But, you know, I'm, I'm sorry about that. Other than that, uh, I actually hope that they have some of these, you know, key villains in here because uh, those villains do make uh, Batman Batman. So at the end of the day, uh, we'll see how this game is. Um, you guys know, man, I love the Batman Arkham series. And uh, we'll see how this is. It comes out late 2024. It's on a, a VR. And um, hopefully, you know, we get gameplay. You know, gameplay trailer, launch trailer, etc. So we'll see, man. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys have a funny time out. Subscribe to the channel. And if you guys are mobile, whenever I said subscribe, like the whole subscribe button just lit up. You see that? That's a, little, it's a new animation that YouTube came up with. Uh, you should definitely click it, though. You, you, you clicked it. Appreciate it. See you guys have a funny time out.